Hi guys, Anna Shell here with another part of 50 Baby Challenge. Um, Hazel's in labor. Let's see. Guess we'll have um, Danielle take her to the hospital. Everybody's wigging. <laughs> oh, I didn't get my baby names up. Dang it. Wabba Zeba do! Bubble Gab! Bubble Gab! Do I even have any more names? <laughs> any more Babylon 5 names, anyway? Yeah, I have three, looks like boys' names. Um. Bubble Gab! Bubble Gab! Might need to open some girls' names, too, then. Alright, calm down. Let's check on the babies. Did they ever get to go potty? Because they had to go potty. They were all piled up at the potty when she started going to labor and stuff. Okay, you're fine. You're tired. <clears throat> Somebody putting you to bed? Oh, yeah, we need to age it. Uh, they're all stacked up on each other. What the heck? Why are you guys stuck up on each other like that? <laughs> okay, come on, camera, cooperate. <laughs> I'm trying to get a picture of them. Move your head to the other side. Uh, I'm trying to get it where I can see both of their heads. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> okay, are you putting her to bed then? Put her to bed, stupid. Yeah, you're not my fairy. You need to go in the crib. Put in crib. Well, we're going to age him up. Oh, we need to age him up. Now just let him do what he wants with her. Because they all learned all their stuff. So, should I just use the, the um, Enros to age him up? The only problem is I'm always worried that it's going to, um, you know, using the cheats and stuff to age them up is going to mess up the game. Oh, I don't want to do it while I get the cakes out, but I don't want to do it until after she has the baby anyway. Everybody gets chocolate. Three chocolate cakes, please. All right. Um, between parts, since I had, um, more than eight sims, I wasn't able to move out, um, Jakar on his own. Oh, Hazel got her stipping. Cool. I wasn't able to move out. Yay, it's a girl! Alright, what do we want to name her? Let's see... There's Heidi. Kind of want to name her something different. There's Zuri. Let's name her Zuri. Z U R I. And I don't know if she's going to have multiples. At least we're having more girls, right? Is a girl. <laughs> I don't want to mess it up again. Zuri. We get to pick both of her traits. Excitable and disciplined. Is that it? She's an alien! That's perfect! I forgot she might be an alien. Guys! Alien, baby! Alright, so they should be on on their way home to Zuri, right? Cool. Alright. So let's blow out candles. Who's first? Lorian. Blow out candles for Lorian. Lorian's having a birthday. Come on, Lorian. Get out of your sister. <laughs> Stop sitting on your sister and go age up. Itty bits of toy. 
Oh, really? Okay. Asking her mom on a date, huh? Oh, oh baby's tired. Our baby needs stuff. Our baby needs stuff. She's hangry. You're not gonna go celebrate. <laughs> Take care of her first. She's an alien. So I think Zuri's a perfect name for an alien baby. Pop right now. Did you go on your date? No, she got distracted. <laughs> but still, he texted her, so. What are you doing, mate? It's not your birthday. Yay, Lorian! That. What are you doing? Come on, Lorian. It's taking ages. There you go. Friendly, genius, light sleeper, another light sleeper, light sleeper, light sleeper. Okay, who's next? Darina? Yay, I'm remembering. Blow out candles for Darina. Dorito. <laughs> Come on, Dorito, age up. That, the maid celebrates a little bit and goes back to work. Somebody coming to get her or what? Why is it taking you so long? The house is not that big. I think this one's just tired. Yeah, she's tired. But you're about to age up, so you're gonna have to wait. Oh, she just picks her up and puts her down. Picks her up and puts her down. What are you doing, eating cake? Nib nib charcuni. Nib nib charcuni. What? Onlookers stared at as Esme and Garibaldi got in a heated argument. Oh, oh yeah. Um, Danielle had a a whim or wish, whatever, to um have oh, grandchildren. Well, she had one that, that she wanted to be a grandmother, which she already is, and then she has this one to have ten grandchildren. But um, and she got credit for it. I'm like, well, Hazel hasn't had the baby yet. But then I remembered that Londo had a baby. They had a baby girl named Suzanne. Suzanne Bird Evans. <laughs> Zamudad? What the heck? Are you kidding me? You caught the cake on fire. <laughs> they just stand there. Anybody gonna do anything? Oh, she's gonna put it out with her wand? Okay. <laughs> Good job, Hazel. Did you get it? <laughs> they get all excited. Okay, why are you guys excited with the cake burnt? Oh, yeah. oh we still got 26 bucks for it. Sweet! I gotta move this one over here. And I can sell this one now, too. All right, Darina, take two. Uh, get a fire extinguisher. You don't have, need a fire extinguisher. You have, um... You guys have wands, Darina. Take two. <laughs> now I gotta cancel them all again, too. <laughs> I really should go back to doing the room thing. This poor girl. Just fall asleep for a minute. There you go. I don't know why she didn't do it sooner. Alright, Darina. 
Darina, heavy sleeper, loves the outdoors. Easily impressed. Okay. Now I need another cake. <clears throat> I've only, well, no, maybe I haven't only seen it happen that way, but usually it um catches on fire when it's like under a cabinet. All right. Blow out candles for Delenn. Who's going to get Delenn? Wake up, Delenn. It's your birthday. Oh, wib -wib. Wib -wib. Hazel actually um, changed her um, clothes this time. When she got pregnant, she actually started showing and changed her clothes. I'm such a meanie. You're already stuffed, Danielle. Stop trying to eat cake. Oh, I might leave her in that dress. She looks kind of cute. Yay, Delenn! Loner, athletic, computer whiz. Awesome! <clears throat> <laughs> what are you crying about? Are you changing um, traits again? Oh yeah, her chait her traits, her traits changed to um, nurturing. Are you even hungry? A little. You're definitely not hungry. You had like twenty pieces already. Nope. You're singing to the doll. Okay, now we can sell cakes. And we still have a bunch of slices everywhere. What time is it? 7 p.m.? Didn't that take like all day? Go to bed, chick. Yeah. I gotta actually assign them beds, don't I? Stop singing to your doll. Ah, who is it? I think it's her. The other girl was just playing with it. Okay, Lorian. Oh, they had, can they sleep in the fairy house? Can they still? Why? Well, I think I want them to sleep in the bed, though, because. Yeah, they can still do all that. I guess if they want to, they can sleep there, but. I'm going to give them beds. Some people say that Gracie Loveland has a terrible secret. Oh, who cares? Who cares? Okay, this is going to be Lorian's bed. Let's see, who's my other fairy? Not you. Darina. This is gonna be Darina's bed. This is gonna be Delenn's bed. There you go. Who, oh, baby's crying. Let's see, Delenn. Needs to go to bed. I think she's sleeping in another bed right now. That's fine. That's fine if you're sleeping somewhere else. Uh, baby's crying, guys. She's lonely. Their little alien cry. Aww. Come take care of your daughter and stop yelling at your son. Are you hungry again? Yep. Not 
seed diaper. Zuri Evans. I kind of like that name for her alien baby. She's an alien baby. And then after that, we need to call and break up with this dude. Since he texted our mom on a date. Oh, it says she's a witch. She's a green skinned witch, guys. Oh, Okay. Interesting. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, I need a breakup text to you. Send breakup text. Mini Polly Tanu. She's still not in the green. Now she stinks. Of course she does. Text him and then take care of your daughter some more. See, Delenn get on honor roll already. <laughs> oh, that was quick. That was down with the quickness. <clears throat> All right. As far as school, let's see. I told you everything, right? You have a C. You did your homework. Oh yeah, they go back to school tomorrow. Um, you're ready for bed, dude. Yeah, I couldn't move out of Jakar. And then, um, it was, um, Irma's birthday. So I just went ahead and I, it was already her birthday. I wasn't aging her up early. So I just aged her up and moved her out with him. Because that's the only way I could move him out. So you can just go to bed. Where's your bed, dude? That's Byron's bed. That must be yours. Okay, you're already in bed. You got your shower and everything. Good. Oh, no, wait. You're not in bed. Oh, she's sleeping in that bed. Okay, you can go to bed. Or the girl's asking for stories. You need a shower. And then you can go to bed. Who are you? Lorian? <clears throat> Lorian, I think this is your bed. Um, Darina? Needs a shower too. And Delenn is already asleep. She'll have to take care of her stuff in the morning. And how are the pets? Pets are good. Pets are hungry. What are you doing? Begging for a treat? Don't wake her up. I need to lock all the doors. Can you eat this cake? Steal food. <laughs> Go get it, cat. Cats like birthday cake too. Oh, you can't get up there? Oh, that sucks. Here. Let me put it on the ground for you. There you go. There you go, kitty. You got some birthday cake. <laughs> All right. You, Missy. Let's see, it's 12.30 a.m. What are you trying to do? Read her a story. You're not going to read her a story. You need to go to the bathroom, though. Woo! Oh, I know what we're going to do. You're not going to bed. You are not. Oh, it's spring. I don't think the festival's on right now. Is it the first day? Yeah. Um, we're, well, we can still go to the park. Yeah, go to the performance park. Take the car. I did make it her preferred vehicle, right? Oh, yeah! 
Um, Kenji and Naomi got married. <laughs> oh, they got married. Yeah, she's taking the car. Yeah, her knees are up. <clears throat> I need to fix her outfits again. Um, where's there it is. Bora. Perform for tips. It feels pretty light for 2 a.m. Is there anybody here? Anybody? Anyone? No. Natalie. Yeah, they're hooking up with like old baby daddies and new baby daddies. But see, uh, well, I don't know if they're going to get divorced. We're going to have to actually go after Quentin. We're actually going to go after Kenji next. Um, yeah, this guy. Yeah. Brother in law. <laughs> uh oh. Oh no, they're fighting. No. No fighting. I know she's not going to get any tips because we don't really need the money anyway, but I want her to work on her performance. We'll let her work on that a little bit so she can get to promote it to level, what, three? Two or three? You're disgraced again with having a child out of wedlock. Falsely accused. She was falsely accused. I like her outfit. Sometimes I just give them those outfits as like every day. As an everyday outfit. <clears throat> oh, who's this? I think she's a paparazzi, isn't she? Lilu. Didn't we turn her into a frog at one point? Baby's lonely. I'll be back, Hazel. <laughs> Baby needs the things. Come on, Grandma. Oh, she got scratched. Oh, she was getting up anyway. Perfect. Perfect. Might as well feed her again, too. Yep, she's hungry again, too. At least she's not going to crap her pants anytime soon. <laughs> Get over here, Grandma. Ma. There you are. Let's see, it's almost six. You're doing that. You're the guy. The guys. I didn't finish checking their grades, did I? Okay, you did your homework. You did your homework. You guys have school today? Yep. But they don't, I don't think they even have homework yet. So. Oh, she has logic level two. Cool. Yeah, they don't have homework yet. <clears throat> she has logic level two. Who is that? Lorian? Um, Darina didn't get a skill. And Delan has logic level one. Cool, cool. What's this? Nicely decorated. Aww. <clears throat> Let's go back and check on Hazel. We should be able to go... Actually, no, I want to do that in the next part. Because the timer's about to go off. We're going to... Oh, she's getting cold. Mm -hmm. We're going to go um, mm -hmm. after Kinji in the next part. And she's getting fatigued. So she'll probably start... She'll probably stop here in a minute. All right, guys, we had our mm -hmm. alien witch baby Zuri. Ooh. And we broke up with her dad. Huh? The, wow. the alien dude. In the next yes, part, we're going to go after Kenji, our brother-in-law. <laughs> All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this part of 50 Baby Challenge, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.